Now that was like a game. Not a game, but a gym. Yeah, well, Carol's, I think it's Carol. Yeah, Carol's beating him pretty bad. Comments, comments from the sky, comments from the 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 sky. If you're an athlete, you never know when an injury might happen. That's why Parkview Sports Medicine has made the new Ortho Express Clinic. Located inside of the Sport One Parkview Fieldhouse, the Ortho Express Clinic has everything that an athlete would need. From physicians to athletic rehab and sports performance. Parkview Sports Medicine, game on. Parkview Sports Medicine continues to lead the way in Northeast Indiana with our new Parkview Ortho Express Clinic, offering direct access to physicians and Saturday morning clinics that are convenient for you. Parkview Sports Medicine, game on. We're here at Hamilton High School, home of the Marines. First round sectional action here in sectional 52. We've got Black Caw leading by a wide margin, 42-21 over Bethany Christian Bruins. Bethany's looking a little uh, shaken, not gonna lie, coming out of the tunnel for the second half. Looked a little out of it. Confidence at an all-time low maybe, but Black Hawk looking heads up, chins up, ready to go. See, see. We're going to see more of the same in the second half. We got 115 to go in the to go until we reach the second half. Thanks for tuning in. SummerCitySports.com. Name's Sean Boswell. Man, the camera's Matt Runyon. We're going to take a break here. Be right back. The comments. Comments from the from the sky. Comments from the from the sky. For an athlete, you never know when an injury might happen. That's why Parkview Sports Medicine has made the new Ortho Express Clinic. Located inside of the Sport One Parkview Fieldhouse, the Ortho Express Clinic has everything that an athlete would need, from physicians to athletic rehab and sports performance. Parkview Sports Medicine, game on. Get mad about blue. Get mad about your Fort Wayne Mad Ants. When looking for the best basketball action in town, it's a... to FortWayneMadAnts.com for the complete game schedule. See your Fort Wayne Mad Ants in action. Get mad about blue. We're here about to start the second half here at Hamilton High School's sectional action. Bethany Christian trailing Blackhawk 42 to 21. Blackhawk with the early three by Davidson to start the half. That's a way to do it. Up 45-21 now. Bethany couldn't quite figure much out in the offensive end here in the first half. Let's see if they drew anything up. That's five second call early. Doesn't look much different than the first half here. Jalen Mole, great point guard. Solid. Feeds Thompson. Thompson's blocked. Rebounded by Kern. Kern, some life maybe for Bethany here. Swami. Kern, got to get off that Jalen Mull's defense right here. Bethany, trying to get something going. When Caleb Shank gets the ball, he might pump fake the pass five times before he <laughs> makes a move. It's worked a few times for him. It's Brenneman. To Kern, Shank, Keys, Setting something up here maybe, Brenneman in the wing, backing down the defender, spinning around, Kern, thought about the shot, didn't take it, 
Feeds the post, Brenneman. Shank in the wing, short. Rebound to Davidson, Davidson goes up. Was groped on the way to the basket. Foul's gonna be on Lucas Brownsburger Keys. Inbound opportunity here for Blackhawk. Jalen Mull looking for somebody. Find Sassmanhausen in the corner. Davidson. First. Tipped away. Davidson's cross court pass to Mull. Right back to him. Looking for Thompson. To Mull. One more pass. Good pass. Sassmanhausen. Good ball movement there by Blackhawk. The three is good. Great ball move. That's what great teams do. Not, no selfish players. Just results. Blackhawks looking good. First round sectionals. Mole kicks it. Five forty eight to go in the third quarter here. Blackhawk leads at forty eight twenty one. Trapped in the wing. Keys looking for somebody. It's Kern. He finds Kaswami. Back to Keys. Keys. Kern's top of the right past half court line. Setting something up here as he's guarded by the 6'8 Thompson. Brenneman, the floater. The shot's no good. Rebound by Davidson. Up the court to Sassmanhausen for three again. In and out, no good, rebounded. Brenneman. Driving to the basket. Finishes with the left, Brenneman. Seth Brenneman. Somebody came to play for Bethany today. Davidson, nice pump fake. Tips back, nails the three, but it's gonna be called for the travel. <laughs> Coach Davidson's not happy with the call. Tom um, Gunton checks in the game for Bethany as well. His number 22, Tristan Moore, his first action of the day. Moore stripped away. That's Davidson. One of the three again. Gets it. It was a two. Who was on the line? Long court pass, Brenneman on the receiving end, drives, goes up with it. No good, rebound at Thompson. Quickly up the court, Mole, the first, first, fouled, tackled. It's gonna go against Caleb Shank. What more can you do against a 6'9 tree like Caleb first? Full speed to the basket. Nice re oh, oh, almost the, the alley-oop was, looked so good. Davidson wasn't able to finish, but rebounds it himself and puts it in for two. Looking to extend their lead, and now 29. Moore, out to Brenneman. <coughs> Excuse me. Kern, getting some pressure by Davidson. Brenneman drives at the left, no good. <coughs> First with the rebound. We've got some sneezes going on. Davidson wanted the shot, didn't get it. Up to Thompson, couldn't pull it through. Sassmanhausen ends up regaining it. Swings it to Mole on the wing, deep three. Rattles in. Blackhawk dominating, 32 point lead right now. No signs of Given up at all. Kearns poked away. Last touch by Thompson. It's number 12, Michael Pulver in the game for Blackhawk. As well as number two, Keys. Three eighteen to go in the third quarter. Bethany inbounding. 
Kern on the wing to Keys. Keys. It's going to be an illegal screen on Brenneman. Blackhawk ball. Jalen Muller bringing it up the court. Pulver gets it to first. First spinning. Finds an opening. Lays it in for two. Full court pass to Burneman. Comes down with it. He gets it out. It's Kern. Kern to Keys. Keys looking for somebody now. It's going to be a hold on Pulver. Pulver's first of the game. Inbound here for Bethany. At the Kern. Keys on the wing, driving baseline. Kern to Moore, to Keys, Keys, driving. Brenneman. Brenneman driving, spinning. Moore to Keys, Keys on the wing. Shot no good, rebound to Thompson. Pulver, bringing up the court. Finds Mull on the wing, a three again, no good. Rebounded by Davidson. Davidson goes up and is fouled on the way up. It's going to be an inbounding. With no shot there. Devin Donaldson in the game for Blackhawk. Caleb Moll checks out. First has it. Out to Pulver, to Donaldson, Donaldson. Gets it Davis in the corner. Good ball movement right now by Blackhawk, just keeping it moving. Davidson for three in the corner, nails it. Oh man, they look good. Blackhawk's looking great right now. Exactly where they want to be right now, heading postseason. Bethany. That's Brown. To Moore. Kern gives the pressure. Moore gets it. And Gunton. To Kern. Back to Von Gunton. Trapped in the corner. Gets it out to Kern. Bethany just not even looking for shots right now. They're just trying to get the ball out of their hands. We have under a minute to go, 50 seconds in the third quarter. Bethany looking for something. Kern drives, steps back. Shot no good, rebounded by Thompson. First, all by himself. Another foul, another tackle. That's first going, strong in the basket. Like I said, what else can you do with a 6'9 tree coming at you? And you're only six foot. Zerbach and Sassmanhausen checking the game for Blackhawk. As well as Shank in for Bethany. Back, looking out, Pulver, Donaldson in the corner. Nails the three. Extends the lead to 30 now with 30 seconds to go in the third quarter. Bethany scored two points here in the third quarter. They've been outscored 22 to two. Nails the three just as I spoke. That's more for three. Tristan Moore, three seconds to go. Sassmanhausen needs a three at the 
at the end of the third quarter, Sassmanhausen nails his fourth of the day. Just when Bethany had something going, Sassmanhausen with the answer. Blackhawk leads it 66 to 26, heading into the fourth quarter, leading by 40. Here at Hamilton High School in Hamilton, Indiana, sectional action, sectional 52, first round action, first game of a doubleheader. Next, next game, Smith Academy versus Lakeland Christian Academy. Maybe it would be a little bit more competitive here. Blackhawk, like I said, outscored Bethany in that quarter. 24 to five. That's a rough quarter. Blackhawk getting some younger guys in the game, get some experience here in the postseason, always nice. Let's get you guys a rest before another game in a couple days. We'll be back here Friday night covering another doubleheader as Blackhawk is going to face the winner of the next game we have, Smith Academy in Lakeland. And Hamilton, the host school, is going to be facing Lakewood Park. For the semifinal action, then we'll be back Saturday night as the winner of those two or those four games. Those two games will be facing off at 7:30 Saturday night here for the sectional championship, Hamilton High School, home of the Marines. It's gonna be Bethany Ball start the fourth quarter. Brenneman gets the inbound. Dribbles up the court. It's tipped out of bounds. It'll be Bethany Ball still. Can't find anybody. It's going to be a five second turnover. Blackhawk Ball. Pulver bringing it up for Blackhawk. Swings at Sassmanhausen for three again in the wing. No good, rebounded. Oh, goes down hard, that's Zerbach. Last touch by Bethany, it'll be Blackhawk ball. Pulver inbounding for Blackhawk. Gets their rock and one. Good finish. Kyle Zerbach. He'll go to the line, try to convert the and one. No good, rebounded finally by number 24, Shank. Brings it up the court for Bethany. Brenneman driving, dishes to Moore. Down to Brenneman in the post, goes up with it, finishes for two. Good finish by Brenneman. Donaldson getting a scream from Hofer. Hofer rolls, steps back for three. The big man in and out, no good. Rebounded by Tristan Moore. Seth Brenneman brings it up for Bethany. Gets it to Shank. Now to Kern. Shank in the corner. Pump fake, no good. Back to Brown. Brenneman backing down the defender. Out to Brown for three in the corner. No good, rebounds are back. Pulver bringing up the court now. Driving, goes up, it's fouled. He's gonna be shooting two at the line. Michael Pulver. Foul 
6.16 to go in the third, fourth quarter. Blackhawk leads it 68-28. Pulver's first shot is good. It's gonna be number 30 in for Blackhawk. Landon Jackway, Jackway. I've seen him play some JV games. That kid can play. Now I'm excited. Pulver's second shot is good. Blackhawks teams the lead to 42. Seth Brennan brings it up. Brown. Looking for Keys, couldn't find him. That's Brenneman. Keys for three on the wing is good. Good shot. Brownsburger Keys. Jackway wanted the three, thought about it, didn't take it. So they're back. Baseline jumper, no good. Rebound to Hofer. Tip back, it's good. The big man <laughs> cleaning up in the middle. Seth Brenneman bringing it up the court. Brenneman drives baseline. It's going to be foul. That's going to be on 34. Serbrock. Bethany inbounding. Got to get it in. Oh, goes down hard. That's Seth Brenneman went down hard, but it's going to be a fast break for Blackhawk. Still down on the floor, Brenneman. That was a tough one. No contact, though, so no foul. Just going to shake it off, see if he can be all right. We're going to check in. Corey Kern in. Seth Brenneman. Bethany Ball. Shank bringing it up the court. 5.08 to go in the fourth quarter. Blackhawk leads it by 43. Brown. Keys driving. Shank. Brenneman to Brown, Brown. Find Shank, Shank. Looking for something, driving baseline. Can't find anybody. Pass away. Going to be intercepted Pulver for the easy two. Another two points for Blackhawk. Pulling away now. Well, they've been pulling away, sorry. It's Keys down to Brown. Round shots, no good. Rebounded by Zerbach. Donaldson brings it up. He drives. Zerbach goes up, blocked, but it's fouled at the same time. He'll be shooting two at the line. First shot, that was good. It's number 13, Logan Garland. Garton, sorry, Garton. Checking in for Blackhawk. Angaswamy in for Bethany. Rock second shot. It's good. That's going to be number 24. Kyle Bleed in the game. For Blackhawk. I've seen him play some JV games, and that kid can play too. Get some good experience here for some young guys on Blackhawk. Leading by 47. Brenneman driving. Jackway's going to be called with the foul. Inbound here for Bethany. Third. 
351 to go. It's Kern. Keys in the corner for three, nails it. Pulver, bringing up the court. Pulver in the wing to Jackway driving. Nice feed to Hofer who goes up for two. I don't know what Coach Mark Davidson was saying there. He didn't seem happy, but I don't know what else he wanted his guys to do there. Seemed like some good ball movement. Hey, I'm not a coach, so he, he knows more than me. It's Brenneman driving. Jackway's gonna be called with another foul. Bethany inbounding. 2.58 to go, the fourth quarter. Keys in the corner. Kern. Kern in the corner. Driving left, finds more. More like for Brenneman. Jackway called for his third in less than two minutes. It's gonna send Brenneman to the line shooting two. Brennan shots no good. Second shot for Brenneman off the mark, rebounded by Pulver. Pulver pushing the pace. Driving, tipped away, gets it out. Garton, rebounded by Goswami. Goswami gets across court to Kern. Goswami looking for Kern. Trying to find Brenneman in the post. More for three, it's good. Garton. Pulver in the corner to bleed, bleed. Pump fake is driving. Hofer. Jackway, Jackway driving now. Finishes with the left. Nice drive. Landon Jackway. Good finish. Got a timeout here by Bethany. Bethany. Have a whole new lineup in for Bethany. Checking in now as Blackhawk Blackhawk leads at 82-37. They've got their reserves in. Looks like Bethany's going to do the same. Get standing ovation here from the parents for the seniors of Bethany as their season comes to a close. Here in sectional action, first round, Blackhawk dominating. That's the story, their size and their speed. Really everything about them, their shooting. The ability for them to get it to the post and then dish out and nail their, their open shots is, is really the formula for success for them and they've done it flawlessly today. Can't wait to see how they keep going. They're going to they're gonna be playing Friday night the winner of our next game, Smith Academy and Lakeland Christian Academy. 133 to go in the fourth quarter here, Hamilton High School, Hamilton, Indiana, home of the Marines. They had the first round bye. They play the Lakewood Park on Friday. They'll be, we'll be covering that game as well. Inbounding the ball, that's in number 10, bringing it up for Bethany, Tyson Miller. The freshman. Yeah. 
Moore on the wing, cross court to number 40. Just, just seen. Intercepted by Jackway. Jackway. Gaston. Good. Garten, sorry. Good pass from Jackway to Garten. Nails the two and one. Get a chance to convert to and one here. Shots no good. Rebounded by Hofer. It's going to be called for the over the back there, though. Bethany Ball. A minute to go in the fourth quarter. Leading 84 37. First game of a doubleheader tonight here at Hamilton High School, home of the Marines. Tyson Miller, there was something in the corner, tipped away, saved by Moore. Miller stripped by Pulver, Pulver takes it away from him. It's gonna dribble out the clock here. If I'm Blackhawk, just dribbling it out. Under 30 seconds to go now. Good game from Blackhawk, good first showing. See if they can keep it going here. Second round action on Friday. But that's only the beginning for tonight. The first game of two, next game, Smith Academy versus Lakeland Christian Academy here at Hamilton High School. Sectional 52 action. Good game from both teams. Congratulations to Blackhawk. Great year for Bethany. Just were outmatched tonight. Thanks for tuning in to SummerCitySports.com. I'm Sean Boswell, man on the camera is Matt Runyon.